Welcome to my channel. Today I'm reacting to a Greek Navy SEALs video. So let's get into this. Well, that takes some coordination right there. See, already this looks like it is identical to Buds almost. And I did read somewhere that Buds is set up very similar to the Greek program because the Greeks in 1957, I think two officers went to train in Virginia with the underwater demolition teams, which are now called the U.S. Navy SEALs. Trying to duck walk carrying a log like that absolutely sucks. If you've ever done any kind of log PT, you know how horrible logs are to try to carry and to, to do that with. It's just not fun at all. But yeah, apparently BUDS and the Greek program has a very similar attrition rate. I think it's like 70% or something. And I don't think the Greeks actually call them Navy SEALs, or maybe they do. I think they're actually called Underwater Demolition Teams, or it's like Underwater Demolition Command. I'm not sure. But I think it's abbreviated M-Y-K, like Nick, I think. I think that's a Greek pronunciation. If you know, then drop that in the comments, because I'm not really sure. What kind of weapons do they use? If you know, drop that in the comments. What was that thing that he was carrying on his belly? If you have any idea, drop that in the comments because I'm pretty curious about what that is. I guess this is some training footage. And what does that say? Can anybody translate what that says? Fast roping onto a boat. That's intense. So in the United States, red smoke means a real world emergency. So when we do training missions, we'll never use red smoke. Is that the way it is in Europe or in other countries? Do you use red smoke for training or is it a real world emergency? That's what I want to know. Oh, that's a nice weapon. In terms of what the Navy SEALs mission is, the United States versus Greece, their SEAL teams, I think it is very similar. I'm not sure about that, but I think I read that the missions are similar. So this 
was the first Greek military video that I've reacted to, and I really liked it. I kind of felt like I was watching some U.S. Navy SEALs budge training. I thought it was fun getting to see some of the stuff they were doing, especially the underwater stuff. And what I really enjoyed about the video was just seeing some of the wide open shots of the blue ocean. I would love to go to Greece one day, so hopefully I can experience that ocean for myself. If you want to help support the channel and the work that I do, you can always buy me a coffee. Link in the description box below. Until next time, why don't you check out this video right here, and thanks for watching.